Hello, Mac once again. As a graphic designer, you should be able to choose colors that work well together in your projects. Not all colors look well or look great side by side. So you may ask, so how do we know which colors work well together? Well, the good news is we have color harmonies or color rules. Now, these are defined relationship between colors. An example would be complementary triad. In fact, let me show you what I'm talking about. So here I'm going to start off with a base color. So I need to look for colors that's, that are going to work well with, uh, with this color. So I'm going to come here and I'm going to click this drop down and you can see it says how many rules. So I'm going to click that down. So now you see we've got a long list of these rules that, um, that I was talking about earlier. Okay, so... In my example, this uh, this color palette I'm creating is for graphics TV. So I'm going to go with complementary. So I'm going to click on that. So straight away you can see that these are the shades of this orange and these are the tints. And the complementary color to that orange is right here below. Okay, so I'm going to choose, I'm going to come here to this rectangle tool and then just draw a rectangle okay so I'm going to change that color to to that okay now I need to create a, a group of colors that are going to work well together now these are the colors that I'm going to, I'm going to apply on my website so I'm just going to highlight these two hold the alt key to duplicate Um, in my head, I'm thinking, okay, the background needs to be really dark, so I may choose this color here. And now, if I'm not happy with shades and tints, I can always come here and choose warm or cool. And again, these are the same colors. It's just um, it's just a different saturation and hues uh, added to them. So on this one, they don't look very nice. So I'm going to come here and choose vivid and muted. So I'm going to choose, say, this color. Okay, I'm going to go back to tints and shades and maybe choose this one. So these are the colors that I'll be using um, throughout my my branding. So this could be applied to, say, artwork, um, business cards, um, across the whole board, really. So I want to show you practical examples where color palettes are used. Right. In this example, you can see they have a color palette there. Okay, so these are the colors that they've chosen for their brand. And you can see where the colors are being applied, um, even in their document. Let me give you one more example. We have here the corporate identity for the London Underground. So I'm just going to flip through um, this document quickly and just go straight to, to where they use the color palettes. Okay, here we go. So again, here you can see they they have chosen specific colors that are going to work with their with their campaign or or their brand. And you can see here on the left where these colors have been applied and I mean how nice they look. This is the end of this tutorial. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to get notified uh, when there are new tutorials and uh, leave some feedback or comments. And thank you for watching.